The Crown Plaza Hotel in Los Angeles was host to the 2012 USA Water Polo Assembly, along with the awards dinner this past weekend, January 13th through the 15th. The assembly gathered the water polo community as staff from USA Water Polo presented updated information from each department, along with an update from FINA's Vice President Dale Newberger on the international scene. Before the presentation, CEO Christopher Ramsey and Chairman of the Board Mike Graff thanked the supporters of USA Water Polo for attending. Staff presentations included finance, ODP, sport development, officiating, and marketing. The second annual referee school followed the presentations and was joined by the first annual coaches summit. The 2012 USA Water Polo Awards Dinner was a highlight of the weekend as a variety of members from the water polo community were honored for their excellence in 2011. The award winners are the Monty Nitzkowski Distinguished Men's Coaching Award for Elite Performance went to Louis Nicolau. The Sandy Nita Distinguished Women's Coaching Award for Elite Performance went to John Tanner. The Bill Barnett Distinguished Men's Coaching Award for Scholastic Performance went to Brian Krutzkamp. The Doc Hunkler Distinguished Women's Coaching Award for Scholastic Performance went to Natalie Benson. The Ted Newland Distinguished Men's Coaching Award for Developmental Performance went to Doug Peabody and Dan Way. The Brent Bolander Distinguished Women's Coaching Award for Developmental Performance went to Manu Gafarfar. The Brett Bernard Distinguished Referee Award for Elite Performance went to Amber Drury. The Tom Hermstad Distinguished Referee Award for Scholastic Performance went to Darren Spiritosanto. The Aaron Cheney Distinguished Referee Award for Developmental Performance went to Rachel McCracken. The Brian Weaver Male Master of the Year Award went to Robert Neely. The Brian Weaver Female Master of the Year Award went to Maureen O'Toole. The Barbara Kalbus Distinguished Volunteer Award went to George Fenton. The Burke Ratkovich Zone Service Award went to Manny Gonzalez of the Coastal California Zone. The USA Water Polo Lifetime Service Award went to Julian Schmidt of Vintage High School in Napa Valley Water Polo and David Perry of Fenwick High School. The Master Club of the Year Award went to the Olympic Club of San Francisco. And the USA Water Polo Chairman's Cup once again went to SoCal Water Polo. Afterward, we got a chance to talk to some of the award winners. I've, I've been to these ceremonies and I've seen the people that have received these awards before and obviously the namesake of the award and to, to be one of the people recognized as somebody um, obviously eligible for awards such as this, I'm, I'm really, really honored. Well, it was great to be here tonight. There's so many people that I admire in the sport and from whom I've learned so much. Uh, and. To receive an award name for Sandy Nita, who was truly an, an entrepreneur in our sports, it meant so much to the growth and development of women's water polo, age group water polo, the diversity of our sport. Uh, that's something that uh, means a great deal to me. It's an absolute honor and a privilege to be here tonight in front of a, a, a world-class uh, group of officials, uh, past and present, and coaches, and, and masters players. and. It's just an absolute honor to be here and uh, to accept an award um, for a job that I absolutely love to do. First, I've, I've got to say that when I got Chris Ramsey's letter, you know, I was taken totally by surprise. I had no idea that I was going to, you know, be awarded this this uh, really cool award. I, mean, I feel uh, kind of overwhelmed, really. Um, I didn't know at the time that. that anybody was going to get the award, much less me, and so. Yeah, pretty fun other than uh, having to wear the coat and tie. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, <laughs> no, it was a really nice event. Yeah. Yep.